This week's episode of AWU is brought to you by Movement Watches. Ah! Hey, what's up, everybody? It is Jeff from Achievement Hunter, and welcome to AWU. From Springfield, Missouri, on our wedding day, this is AWU number 320. <laughs> For the week of June 6, 2016. Hey, so I'm going to be out next week over at E3, so if you find me on, over in Los Angeles, feel free to say hi. We're going to be uh, broadcasting from the, the show floor. We're doing our YouTube gaming stuff again, the YouTube E3 stuff again, and uh, come out and check it out if you're there, or watch us on gaming.youtube.com. It's going to be uh, pretty cool doing a lot of E3 coverage all week. Hey, a really cool thing's happening right now as well. If you like charity, if you like Child's Play, one of our charity guys that we support, go check out the game Thumb Drift. It's, a, it's an iOS game, and uh, right now, for this week, from uh, I think this Monday until next Sunday, if you use the RT Tactical Vehicle, which they just released in the game, the developers of the game are actually going to take the high score and donate that amount of money to Child's Play on behalf of Rooster Teeth. So there you go. So Thumb Drift, check it out. Um, it's, it's pretty cool. Hey, making some money for charity. It's a good time. So check it out. And the RT Tactical Vehicle. Make sure you use that when you set the score. Hey, a uh, special thanks goes out to our fan, Cotter, who uh, just sent us an amazing... Look at this. So he, he saw us playing the Uncharted Let's Watch. I, made, I just pushed it. And look at that. He sent us a box with wheels. And then he also sent us a bunch of uh, red shirts. Because Sully's red shirts... All right. Ryan, no. And then uh, look at salt and vinegar chips as well, because there's lots of uh, salt and vinegar in Uncharted. Uh, I don't have a cigar though, otherwise I'd be silly. Yeah. So thank you very much, Cotter, for that. That is really good. That's funny. That's that's some good fan stuff right there. Thank I'm you very much. I'm bang Nate's wife. Hey, if you're in Los Angeles next week, don't forget Let's Play Live is June 17th at the Dolby Theater in Hollywood. That's right. Go to roosterteethlive.com to buy tickets for it. It's it's gonna be badass. Trust me. We've, we've got. It's gonna. You're gonna want to go. You're gonna want to be there for sure and tell all your friends about it. So or just bring them too. Yeah, roosterteethlive.com. Buy your tickets right now. Uh, okay, let's see. Got some video games for you. <sighs> let's go with the consoles first, shall we? Mirror, Mirror's Edge Catalyst. Uh, Just Cause 3 Land Mech Assault DLC is coming out this week. Uh, Atelier Sophie, the alchemist of the mysterious book for the PS4. The things they call games. You want some chips? Paragon. Uh, no, I'm good, thank you. Donut? Uh, the Soulless Project well, for the Xbox and the, play and the, the personal computer. SteamWorld Heist. For the PC and the PS4. Guilty Gear XRD Revelator for the PS4 and PS3. Odin Sphere Life Thrasser, L E I F T H R A S I R. The Book of Unwritten Tales, Part 2 for the Wii U. Puzzle Labyrinth for the 3DS. Soul Axiom for the PlayStation 4. Color Symphony 2 for the Xbox. Are you serious? Phoenix Furia and In Between, both for the Xbox. Oh my god. Grim Legends, The Forsaken Bride for the Xbox. MXGP2, the official motocross video game for the Xbox One. Holy shit. Kirby Planet Ro Robobot. Sherlock Holmes, The Devil's Daughter. That sounds. Kind of hot. Uh, that's for PlayStation and Xbox and stuff. And then uh, here is a long-ass PC list. Let's just uh, read a few, shall we? Edge of Nowhere for the Oculus. So I have to read them all because they're just... on an edge of nowhere. Dude, you're the one going was going to be fake. This list. Parts of Iron 4, Soul Trader, S-O-L. Crush Your Enemies, Combat Air Patrol 2, Gain, Rising Runner, Stranger of Sword City, Tanker, Vroomist, Excavalopolis, Bears, Bees, Boars, and Battleships. There's your game of the week. That's uh, the fake one. That might be the fake one, right? Blam Down, Utter Fury. Legacy of the Elder Star. That's just really Sims elaborate. 4, Dine Out. That's Oo frank, yeah. Ufo Online Invasion, Wasted, Funk Lift, Heart Z, Co-Hope Puzzles, Crimson Room Decade, Dino Eggs Rebirth, Doodle Academy, Ducati, 90 anniversary. Fantastic Mosaics 14, 14 fourth, oh, you're swaying with me, aren't you? Fourth yeah. color. You just noticed? I've been noticed for a while. It's been fun. Oh, okay. Fracture the, fracture the flag. I get this call every day. Shmups skill test. All of these sound fake. Just sounds like a pile of bullshit. This week only one is real. Star chart. Storm VR. TikTok bang bang. Tix tales. Feudalism. Four realms. Lead it rain. One small fire at a time. VR. One of these is a sneaky sneaker, but you knew that already. All right. So do you, do you... I think it's the uh, Bears, Bees, Battlestar Galactica one. Jack, it is. Bears, Bees, Boars, and Battleships. Hey! Nailed it. We've never gotten one wrong. Uh, all right. Achievement of the week this week is in uh, Mirror's Edge Catalyst. It's called Bell of the Ball. And all you have to do to get this achievement, it's really simple. Vault, slide, jump, wall climb, turn, jump, wall run, turn, jump, skill roll. Oh, yeah, that's easy. Yeah. Art of the week this week is Simrel. It's me and Jack as... <laughs> 
I got nothing to do with this one. It's, it's so cute. It will not. The goddamn Harry Potter thing will not die. It never. Oh, man. It won't. It'll never die. What is dead? Just like a Gryffindor's courage. Hey, community. Community video of the week this week is the best of Achievement Hunter for May 2016 by Here They Call Me. So check it out. <laughs> I'll be honest, Jeff. It took us four holes to get here, but we got it. We did. We did. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Good! <laughs> All right, so as far as news goes this week, hey, you know Volition, the guys who make Saints Row? They just announced a brand new game called Agents of Mayhem. Uh, very little is known about it right now. They just released a CGI trailer, but hey, you guys who did Saints Row are making a new game. You know, uh, that's going to be fun times. Maybe you'll hear more about it at E3. And like I said before, E3 is going to be next week, and Rooster Teeth is going to be out there. We're going to be covering it for YouTube Gaming again. <laughs> Whoa, uh, we're gonna be covering it. It's gonna be lots of fun. Look for some of your favorite Rooster Teeth personalities talking about video games and interviewing people during E3 and also me. So uh, yeah, your favorites and me. And uh, one cool thing about EA, or about E3 is uh, EA, so Electronic Arts, instead of doing a proper kind of press conference thing where it's just, just for you know the, the, the press and whatnot, they're doing a thing called EA Play. So anyone can go check it out. You can look online for more details about it, but yeah, they're opening it up. They're not really having, they're not having a booth at E3 behind closed doors. They're having a big public thing. So if you wanna go play Battlefield 1 or Titanfall 2, or the new FIFA, new Madden. It's all going to be available for people on the, uh, just anyone in Los Angeles who wants to come out and play. That's pretty cool. I like the uh, the new take on what E3 could become. So that's it. It's kind of a light week this week because uh, everyone's holding off for E3. Here's Jeff with the video of the week. Video of the week this week. It's uh, Rage Quit, Ang Angry Video Game Nerd 2, Assimilation. Assimilation. Assimilation, like poop. Yeah. yeah. So uh, that's your video of the week. Watch it if you want to see Michael be mad at stuff. Stop hitting the fucking ceiling! No, 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 get away! Fuck! You motherfucker, he's gonna rip my fucking anus off! It's my last life already, I was doing so well! Versatility is everything when it comes to accessories, and the great thing about movement watches, you can switch from a leather band to a metallic one for a completely new look. With movement, there's no limitations. If you're wearing brown shoes with a brown belt, just strap on a brown leather movement band and you're in business. To give an example how easy the process is, I'm gonna demo switching out the watch bands. It's always a great practice because options are everything, right? Okay, so here's the watch right here. Really nice movement watch. There's little things on the back, all you gotta do... Oh, thank you very much, Michael. There's little, little tabs. All you gotta do is just pull that down, and look at that. It pops right off. And so you can just replace it. You can swap it out for new bands. And there we go. You get lots of options. Or maybe you just put this on a chain, carry it around like that. Or you swallow it. No, don't swallow it. That's a bad idea. All right, so now I've got this uh, this band in here. I can swap it out with whichever one I want. But they've got a ton of other bands to choose from. It's really an awesome system. Your movement watch is going to start at 95 bucks. Then you've got all these other watch bands and options and stuff. You can pick different ones you want. Add, you know, add them to your cart, whatever. Uh, three bands, three colors. Almost like having three different watches. Some band gives the watch a classier feel, while others are cool and casual. Uh, if you need some help knowing which band will look best, Movement offers an interactive chat on their site for assistance. Check it out. If you are as impressed as I am with this watch, then join the Movement today. So go to mvmtwatches.com slash awu, and I'll give you 15% off your entire purchase. That's right, mvmtwatches.com slash awu. Thank you, Movement. Uh, I'm going to go back and play some uh, new uh, Mirror's Edge. That looks fun. See you guys next week. From the Ruby Showing in St. John's, Newfoundland, this is... From All these Island, South Carolina, you're watching Awu 320! From the Level Up Expo in Las Vegas, Nevada, this, this is, is Awu number 320! Hey, what's up guys? It's Thomas and the Megans at the Ferris Wheel at the Abandoned Amusement Park next to Chippewa Lake in Northeast Ohio, and this is... Awu 320. This is Central Valley, California, Rooster Teeth, and we are here to watch Ruby Volume 1, and this is Awu 320! Woo! It's the face of a Hufflepuff. <laughs>